Uh, joining us for the latest managerial interview is joint manager Neil Baker. Um, eventful game <laughs> here at uh, Vauxhall Road, Hemel Hempstead. Um, not really in the game a lot, didn't have a lot of great chances. Different formation today? Yeah, yeah, went 4-1, um, 4-1, four, one, four, one, obviously. Uh, ben wasn't fit. We, we felt that uh, Igtel and Max had come on on Saturday, and felt that they'd, um, you know, they'd, they'd probably deserved deserved the start. So we just just felt that we wanted just to change it very slightly today. Um, it's really difficult here because it, it's quite a big slope, and uh, first half it's very difficult to actually, you know, obviously we're going up the slope, and it's actually quite difficult to get out as centre halves as Norfi is kicking was sort of going out because I, I don't know. It's just it's, it's difficult. It's hard and. Uh, and we were, we were actually delighted that we went in one all because they had a, a really good period where I think they had like 15, 15, 20 minutes where they were right on top, you know, quite a few balls fizzed across goal. Northies made a couple of saves. Um, and I felt that they probably deserved to be in, you know, probably in front um, on, uh, in the first half, you know, at half time. So we were delighted to get in at half time. Obviously, delighted for, for George, you know, to get his first goal for the club. Um, you know, good work from Alfonso. You know, pulling it back for him. But yeah, um, it was. Uh, it, it probably wasn't the, the, the greatest first half. Um, I think it. You know, the fireworks came. You know, 15 minutes into the second half, didn't they? You know, and uh, obviously Northey's come come out, and I think the ball's fizzed off the surface, and I think he's obviously thought it's going going to go past, and they're probably going to score, and he's just put out a hand, and you know, it's just it's a, it's a red card. There's no complaints our end, and. You know, obviously with no Ben Harris, who's probably uh, your go-to in goal. Um, uh, we were sort of looking around for somebody to step up, and you know, Lenchy stepped up, and you know, I thought he was fantastic. I mean, what a save he made as well. So um, didn't get in the first team. He didn't start Lenchy today. No. Uh, reason for that at all? Just as I said, you know, we felt that Max and Etel um, deserved to start. You know, nothing more than that. You know, we've we've got a good squad of players here. Um, Everyone wants to play. Everyone wants to play every minute, but you can't. You know, we've we've got a squad of players, so uh, yeah, that was the decision we made. You know, nothing nothing at all in it. It's just uh, yeah, one of those things. So, uh, but he say he came on, and uh, he showed real character today to to do that. I guess when you brought him on, you were probably expecting him to spend um, thirty five minutes on the field in the centre of the park. <laughs> yeah. um, he ends up in goal. Like you say, he made a great save early on in his time, but he was protected so well by the defence. It wasn't really much that he had to do no there, there wasn't but what he did he did well you know and um it's always very difficult I, i've done it myself you know when i was a player I, i've i've ended up going in goal and it's mentally it's really really difficult we were just talking actually because um you're not when you're used to kicking a ball uh, like from a place kick uh, you know from a goal kick it's so different you know because you all of a sudden you've got to put so much on it and you're not used to it so i, I used to really struggle with like the kicking and lenchy said he found it quite quite difficult as well but Listen, as I said, massive character to you know, massive character for him to step step up. Massive character from the team to dig in. Um, you know, how good would it have been to come away with three points? I mean, it would have been amazing. Uh, but you know, we're really happy with the point. You know, I felt I felt it was probably a fair result, and I thought Hemel at times were really good today. Um, but no, I, I'm 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 going away really really proud of of what they did, especially second half. And um, yeah, it's, uh, I think it's been a good day, really. One person I do want to pull out for a specific reason um, is Alfonso Tenconi up front today. He played up front basically on his own. Yeah. He's covered so much of the pitch. He's worked hard. He's got an assist. The goal comes out of just his, pure his goal, isn't it? determination yeah. to yeah. get the ball, chases his own flick on. Um, how impressed and how oh. grateful are you that he's here for the season? Oh, yeah. I mean, absolutely. I mean, he's. He's clearly a clearly a, a great lad. Um, worked his socks off. Uh, has come in and and done ever so well. Uh, brilliant lad, you know. Obviously, uh, a fantastic family. You know, they You know, he's got his head screwed on. You know, he knows what he wants. He knows what he wants to do. And you know, he's got a plan in place for obviously going to America and, and things like that. And yeah, he's a wonderful lad. You know, work. The thing for us is, is we like players who work hard, you know, because when you work hard, you you you, you earn the right, and um, and he does that, and, and he, you know, as you say, his goal comes from just harrying and, and hustling, and and it's just a, a bright finish. So, you know, it's four and eight games for him, which is a sensational return, to be honest, for an eighteen-year-old. And, and as I say, he's, he set up the set up the first goal. So, uh, but yeah, great from him. And, and say, all round today, I thought. Um, George, Cooley, Scott, you know, 
the whole team deserve praise for that second half performance especially um, because that was real back to the walls and that was a real slough town performance and uh, yeah really really pleased what I would say is the lad I know their lad got sent off at the end for the tackle on Cawley um, fair play to him because he's, he's, he's you know as Cawley's come in he's He's made his way to, to find him to make sure he was okay and he said it wasn't intentional and you know he, won't, he knows he went over the top but fair play fair play to him for doing that um yeah i thought i thought you know if you're a neutral especially in that second half it was probably a really really quite interesting game to watch but uh we'll take a point away from home it keeps keeps us sort of ticking along nicely in the league and um yeah as i said it's uh, a, a real I'm, I'm i'm really pleased tonight thanks Joe, Neil. Great thanks, hey, cheers. cheers thank you